nervous about it. You ready to fight? You ready? All right, two of the best heavyweights in the world, Seal Ogan and the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion, John Jones. And about 48 hours after they met the first time, Seal Ogan was back in France in a singlet. We'll see if it pays dividends tonight. Seal Ogan has his mind focused on the things that he needed to do in order to get back to John Jones. We see it tonight. But in John Jones, you have a very well-rounded guy, a guy that is now finding his home in the heavyweight division. This is a massive fight, and that's why people are so excited. Oh, great block there. Oh, man, how is he standing? Brutal knee to the body. Oh, great entry. Well, two heavyweights move as well as the former interim champ, Cito Don, and you see the footwork right away as this fight gets started. Yeah, the footwork leads to the jab. The guy does a great job of moving into you, and then he pops you. And then the moment you start to rush, he drops the big right hand on you. Cyril Gunn is a hard, hard puzzle to solve, especially as you go up in weight classes. Heavyweights don't move like Cyril Gunn, and you can see that as we watch him right now. Back and forth we go. supposed to be and if you do that most times you will a little bit concerned, perhaps because of that cut on the lip that was opened up there in that round. Starting to bleed pretty good. Cut man's got his work to do now. Well, he had a lot more than a puncher's chance coming in. Big knockdown for him in the previous round. DC, talk us through the highlight. He got in his opponent's face, landed that big punch that put his opponent flat on his back. He couldn't get the finish, but if he lands one more time just like that, he will get the victory. You ready? Round two is underway. Oh, nice elbow. Jones's elbow attempt here blocked by the defense. Big elbow there, Lance. Well, at this point, hard to blame him for head hunting, right? He has caused some significant swelling upstairs and continues to attack that area to great effect. Absolutely. I mean, the guy has done a great job recognizing where he had an advantage, where he has an ability to separate himself from his opponent. He's done exactly that, and it's showing in his opponent's face with all that swelling. Oh, he continues to land with these elbows. You might get a cut here. Yeah, he looks a little wobbly on his feet. Strikes are just brutal. Oh, 
Well, he's going to enjoy watching this one back. Let's take a look at the replay of the knockout just a moment ago. It was right hand after right hand after right hand. Finally, he found the one that hit the exact sweet spot that ended his opponent's night. All right, here's Bruce Buffer now with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at one minute, 26 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout, John!